I have to be honest with you. I've seen and done a lot of things. But I don't like talking about it. I'm actually... So back at it again? Yep. Back at it again. Bum bag. Bum bag bench sets. Feeling strong? No. Nope. Not gonna lie, I don't feel strong. Physically. Mentally I'm all there, strength. But physically I don't feel strong. Fuck it. <laughs> Never take the two weeks off gym again. You do it. <laughs> <laughs> you might be wondering what happened. Where did I go the last how long? Two weeks or whatever it was. Yeah, He's just... waiting for a mate. Yeah. <laughs> what happened, mate? What's going on? I'm just waiting for a mate. Is that why your car's all smashed up and you're up on the grass at the moment, or what? Yeah. Just yeah. from mate. How, how, how'd the collision with your car happen, mate? What collision? Well, the one that's got your, all your wheels and stuff twisted up and your, your, your front bumper bar's hanging off, mate. Well, I'm just waiting for a mate, as I said. Who's your mate? Hey? Who's your mate? James. No, I was, uh, yeah, I went out in Vegas. And uh, with James and my little sister, had a great time. And then um, came back and then, uh, yeah, I just wanted to go to Europe. So I went to Greece, Madrid, Munich. Just have a bit of a break, just chill out, catch up with a mate, up on the hill. Found some, uh, some pretty cool places over in Greece, up in uh, Macedonia. Uh, went to the mountains and to the, the monasteries up there. Um, it was pretty cool. Just chilled out, yeah. I just went and just had a break from the gym and social media and all that sort of stuff. Just kind of wanted to, because uh, um, just kind of do my own thing for a little bit. Uh, refreshing and uh, sharpen and my mind and let's get ready for the next few months of training and a bit more traveling to do. So there's a few trips coming up. So just kind of reset everything. Just ride bikes around Madrid and walk around the parks and stuff. So anyway, back back now for a few days. I've got to go to Korea next week for a little bit. And then uh, hopefully I can get into some consistent training because right now it has not been consistent. Uh, I haven't, I've only trained once in the last two weeks and I haven't been eating much apart from pasta and chocolate and not drinking much water. So I'm, yeah, this is kind of giving it all the rest. So anyway, so I'm feeling a little bit weak, but it's all about building, strengthening this one, the head, the mind. So strong, so strong. How do you like that one? You like it? Oh uh, yeah, it's good. It's, fuck. it's good. It's a nice squeeze. Oh, is that a new shirt? Yeah, it's called um. Uh, it's called Never Been Washed and Never Been Changed. And a couple holy, moths got couple, into it. A couple of moths <laughs> got into it. This is back in the bulking days. I didn't. Uh, I just used to rip out of my shirt. But, nah, it's an oldie. An oldie bit of goodie. I have to be honest with you. Um, I'm actually a ninja koala, and uh, I've seen and done a lot of things. I don't like talking about it. I've seen and done a lot of things I'm not proud of. 
sometimes I have to disappear far, far away to strengthen and sharpen and refocus my mind. But I'm also a robot, so I don't have feelings. So I don't care about all the bad ninja koala shit I've done. It's just hard to talk about because my chip is rusted. <laughs> All I know is how to lift weights and maybe get a few dates. Probably pump for a while, so. There's some pecs under here. I can feel them. I just need to wake them up a bit more. I need to feed them. Wait. Watch your hands, watch your fingers, watch your fingers. Oh, that's jammed in real tight. Push it up. Yeah, you hold that. Fuck, someone got a real good number on it. Just stomp on it. <laughs> this fucking home renos. Uh, do it yourself, fix it. What was that guy in Australia? Backyard something? Who? Hey. What was that guy in the backyard show? The backyard what? There's a guy in Australia, no, like no. backyard. No. Bob's backyard? Bob's. Bert's backyard. Bert's backyard. Um, pull this one. Better homes and gardens. Better homes and gardens. Yeah, I've got a. We need like a. Uh, a, a um, we need some WD 40. No, a little screwdriver or something like that. This might do it. Just grab the pin itself. Yeah, maybe that'll be. I'm just gonna pull the cable like that bit. There we go. Sweet. Good as new. Can't tell I'm a fucking idiot. Fuck the cable. So after we gotta take a look at it. Ah, oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> hey, fix their own. Nice and smooth. Huh? Oh, nice yeah, and smooth. nice and smooth. Sometimes you gotta put a bit of WD 40 on or just home lube. Move it up. Get in the whole lot of it. Incline. What the fuck? 
my chest thing, the flies. And I will do. Uh, I don't know. One more? One more exercise, yeah. I'll have a, I'll have a think over here. Ever done this machine on the YouTube before? Have I? I don't think so. This is the ages ago, but little hidden gem. I haven't actually seen it in any other gyms before either, so it's a pretty sweet machine. It's kind of like a, it's a combination of a bench press and a and dumbbell fly. fly. Yeah. So you get like the top and chest movement, and at the top you bring it in and you can squeeze it. So instead of a bench press, where you just fixed in one position, you can press it and then you squeeze it in. A bit like a dumbbell bench press but with, a, with the machine. Change it up. Oh, wow. That's my voice I've done for the week. <laughs> <sighs> so Arnold Classic Ohio? Uh, I don't know. What do you think? Think about it? Should I go? Or should I just chill out here? Uh-oh. I'm gonna hide. Alright, there we go. Alright, see you guys, you gotta go. <laughs> nice to meet you, sir. Nice to meet you, sir. How are you doing? Well, you got here just in time. What? For my last set. Nice. <laughs> What'd you do? What? Nah, no, chair. Yeah. What, what have you been doing? I thought you were like, good to go like after. Yeah. I'm sleep. sleep. Oh, sleep. Sleep, eat. Sleep, eat. Yeah, I fucking do a real workout, not like a bunch of fucking girls here. Call it a night? Yep, call it a night. Back tomorrow. Huh? Go and eat some sausages and bagels for dinner. Yeah. Or some cereal or some tuna and noodles. Yeah, just on the, the Dillagaff diet. Does it look like I give a fuck? Nah, I'll be back. Get some good food in and sharpen up. Two months. I'll be, I'll have an impenetrable chest and uh, big cannonball deltoids and some nice quads again. Feeling good, right? 